Editorial, How the Fed Sold Out Our Labor Force A series of social media posts by a prominent academic have raised concerns about this country's temporary foreign workers program, TFWP. Specifically, it focused on how recent changes to the program are wreaking havoc on the labor market. Dr. Mike Moffat is an assistant professor at Ivy School of Business in London, Ontario, and a senior director at the Smart Prosperity Institute at the University of Ottawa. He's also co-host of the podcast The Missing Middle and a self-professed progressive. In a thread posted on X, Moffat explains how the number of temporary foreign workers allowed into this country nearly tripled in 2022. This program is separate from the one that allows in agricultural workers. The federal government made some massive changes a mere 13 days after the Liberals and NDP signed the Supply and Confidence Agreement, he says. That deal gave the NDP more power than they've ever had, he points out. The Liberals specifically knew that doubling temporary foreign workers would suppress wages. They said so back in 2013 to 14. And in 2023, their government more than doubled them, he said. The low wage stream allows Canadian employers to hire temporary foreign workers for jobs that pay less than the provincial median wage. If a Conservative government had done this, there would be pitchforks on the streets. When Liberals and NDP do it, all we get are yawns.